Hi, and welcome to this Nutshell tutorial video. Today's topic is how to perform a docking rendezvous on the daytime side of a planet. While there are many different methods for intercepting another vehicle's orbit, I've chosen this one due to the ease of understanding how to execute it, and also the fact that it will help you to break out of an orbital resonance that might otherwise make a rendezvous difficult. First, select the other spacecraft as your target, and look at the orbital inclination. Create a maneuver node on either the ascending or descending node, and adjust the maneuver upward or downward accordingly. When you see the nodes slip away from the maneuver's position, the new inclination should be fairly precise. Execute the burn, and your nodes should show zero inclination. Then, choose a location for the rendezvous that is on the morning side of the planet. Since your orbit is larger than the planet itself, the location can be slightly behind the morning terminator, to maximize the amount of daylight you will have for docking. However, the location is your choice at this stage. Create a maneuver on the opposite side of the orbit from where the rendezvous will begin. Pull the prograde handle to add velocity until the orbits touch at the chosen location. Verify that they meet up precisely and adjust further if needed. Time warp to the maneuver and execute your burn. You can fine-tune the orbit after completing the burn using RCS with the H and N keys for forward and reverse thrust respectively. You are now in a transfer orbit that will intersect with your target's orbit. Create a new maneuver node at the intersection point. Right-click on the maneuver to view the plus and minus buttons for adding additional orbits to the maneuver's scheduled time. Add as many orbits as is necessary until the interception icons converge near the maneuver. If the target's estimated position marker is behind you in the orbit, you can use the prograde handle to add velocity, which will increase your orbit, and also increase the orbital period, so that the target ship can catch up with you in one more orbit. You may have to orbit several times, depending on how your maneuver was scheduled. Time warp through these orbits until you nearly reach the intended start of the maneuver. Starting the burn slightly early can help you execute it more accurately. After this burn, time warp through the remaining orbit until you are close to the intersection indicated in the orbit. The nav ball should automatically switch to target mode. Using this, you can now align your spacecraft to point at the retrograde marker and execute a burn to reduce your relative velocity to zero. By removing the relative velocity, you will now be in a matching orbit with your target. Thrust towards your target as indicated on the nav ball, but slightly off center to avoid a collision. As you approach, turn around and thrust toward the retrograde marker to remove your relative velocity again and begin your final docking approach. Orient your spacecraft to face opposite your target as best you can using the method of your choice. Now you should only need the RCS translation controls and the nav ball to complete your docking maneuver. When moving toward the target, the prograde marker will tend to push the target's direction marker away from itself. Use this visual cue to move the target marker towards the center of the nav ball using the translation controls. Once centered, translate the prograde marker into the center as well, and you will be on target. Complete the approach, and the ships should easily connect. For more detail and a longer tutorial video, click the link below for the full version. I hope you've enjoyed this quick tutorial and found it useful. Thanks for watching!